Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my week 36 update of my fitness journey. As you can see, we changed up the locations because I just honestly didn't feel like filming in my room. And Sherry's actually behind me eating lunch. Hi. And I'm just gonna quickly film this. So like normal, I'm just gonna tell you what I did this week and then we'll jump into the updates and then the photos. So starting off on Saturday, I did nothing. <laughs> Then Sunday, I did day one of week 28 on Pamela's workout, home workout plan. It's not the sweaty hard, it's not the beginner. So basically I'll put everything on the screen. I'm just gonna run down like verbally what I did and then I'll put like a little montage with like the photos of the thumbnails and my working out. Then we'll get into the updates. So when I follow her plans, it's a lot easier because um, I just run down the days I go. So on Sunday, I did day one, which was the sweaty abs, and that was the hardest day. And then on Monday, I did day two, which was the upper body workout. I love her upper body workout plans. Um, they're really challenging, especially the ones with the water bottles. And then Tuesday, I don't work out because it's my day working from home and I just don't really feel like working out and then Wednesday I do still work but I also uh, fit in a workout plan in that day so on Wednesday I did day three I did the booty workout so it's booty there was three videos dedicated to the booty and then no workout on Thursday I was gonna work out on Thursday but then I'm like eh screw it so I just didn't end up doing Thursday and Today, Friday, I ended up doing day five of the plan that I'm talking about and it's the take it easy day. And it was really good because I had um, a hair appointment, like a hair consultation this morning and I came home eight and I'm actually glad that I did the take it easy after I ate or else I think my stomach would not feel very well. Okay, so before we get into the updates, I'm just going to play you the montage and show you guys the workout. So if you don't want to see this part, you can just skip over it. Starting off, the first update I'm gonna say is the 30 minutes per day workout plan isn't challenging like some of the other workout plans she does, like the sweaty hard. Um, this one was pretty chill this week and that's good because I'm kind of getting back in the swing of things. We got our Fit Life Foods this week, which is really good because it helps like with routine and I don't know, it's just more organized. So I'm glad that um, we're getting back on Fit Life Foods and working that back into the schedule. And with my motivation, I think doing the 30 day wasn't that bad because I'm like, you know what? It's just half an hour. I watch videos that are half an hour long and I can do a workout for that short amount of time. And it helped me just say, you know, I could do this and push through and everything like that. But overall, the workouts in this plan that I did were not very difficult, meaning I didn't sweat as much, but at least I was doing something productive and staying consistent within the plans. Also, I am about to start my lady days anytime now, and I'm just like bloated, and it's kind of like made me a little bit more tired. I also have this like twitch thing going on in my face, which is really weird, but it slowed down a little bit, but I think it's because like, you know, 
eye strain probably that's what we think it is um i also this doesn't have anything to do with working out or whatever but i had a hair consultation like i said earlier and i'm really excited because i think i'm gonna do like a really pretty ombre with my hair and i think it's gonna look really really good so um that's coming next month it's probably like a, yeah i think it's about a month away that i am planning on getting my hair done i'm so excited oh i also want to talk about gym shark I know the whole controversy with that, uh, but I'm still going to wear my Gymshark because I spent a good amount of money on it and I think it flatters my body, but I'm definitely not probably gonna get anything else from them. I mean, I wasn't even planning on getting anything else from them like in the near future. I just wanted to try that specific workout set. So I have kept up with the news on that and I think that's pretty much it for the little updates um let's move on to the photos i love doing these videos because it helps keep me accountable too for working out even when i'm a little unmotivated <laughs> so moving on to the pictures alex last week is on the left and alex this week is on the right i'm surprised because i thought these photos were going to be worse than they actually kind of turned out which is surprising and then here is the side view of that and then going on to pre-workout Alex versus now. So pre-workout Alex is on the left and current Alex is on the right. And here is the side view of that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Question of the day. Sherry, what should the question of the day be? If you're gonna dress up for Halloween, what would you be? If you are dressing up for Halloween, celebrating Halloween, anything, what are you going to be this year? That is a very good question, Sherry. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you.